All right, video creator, you've got my attention. Your title sounds like a winner. Now, what exactly is an AI agent? By the way, I'm 79, but I'd be happy if you explain this stuff like I'm 10. So, go on. Okay. This video is available in multiple languages. Choose your preferred language from the settings and select the audio track you prefer. Part one, the AI revolution is here. Not long ago, AI was just a tool that followed commands, but today it's becoming something much bigger, an assistant that can think and act on its own. At CES 2025, NVIDIA's CEO Jensen Huang took the stage and revealed a breakthrough, AI that works without waiting for instructions. This changes everything. So what exactly is this new kind of AI? Part two, what is agentic AI? Imagine an AI that doesn't just respond, but actually plans, decides, and takes action. That's agentic AI. It's not just a chatbot. It sets its own goals, gathers data, and works independently. Companies like IBM call it the next big step in AI-driven problem solving. But why is this happening now? Part three, why is agentic AI rising now? At CES 2025, NVIDIA introduced its Cosmos platform, a system that uses advanced AI to power robotics and self-driving cars. A recent Deloitte study shows that more than one in four companies are already experimenting with AI agents to handle everyday tasks. The demand is here, and businesses are moving fast. But how did we get to this point? Part four, the evolution of AI, how we got here. AI has come a long way. Think of it in four stages. First, perception AI, machines that recognize faces and sounds. Next, generative AI, systems that create text, images, and music. Then, agentic AI, AI that takes independent action, like scheduling meetings or fixing software bugs. Finally, physical AI, robots and autonomous systems that operate in the real world. Each step built on the last, leading us to today's AI revolution. So how does agentic AI compare to generative AI? Part five, agentic AI versus generative AI. You've probably used generative AI. It creates content based on your prompts. Agentic AI, on the other hand, doesn't need step-by-step -step instructions. It decides what needs to be done and does it. Imagine an AI that not only writes a report, but also figures out which report is needed in the first place. That's the difference. But where is this actually being used? Part six, real world examples. Around the world, businesses are adopting agentic AI. In California, AI powered customer support systems solve problems before users even notice them. In Germany, AI monitors industrial machines to prevent breakdowns before they happen. Salesforce plans to introduce digital AI workers to handle routine tasks, freeing employees for creative work. It's no longer just a theory. It's happening right now, and big tech companies are taking notice. Part seven, big tech is joining the race. Google is training AI to plan ahead. OpenAI's new tool, Operator, already handles complex tasks like booking flights and managing schedules. Meanwhile, NVIDIA is leading with its Cosmos platform and powerful new Blackwell GPUs. The future is clear. AI assistants are becoming a normal part of everyday life. But what does that mean for jobs? Part eight, the workforce shift, changing the way we work. Agentic AI is transforming industries. Companies are cutting costs and working faster, but this also means employees need to adapt. Soon, IT teams won't just fix computers, they'll manage AI assistance. Instead of replacing workers, AI will take over repetitive tasks, allowing people to focus on creativity and strategy. Of course, new technology always comes with challenges. Part nine, the challenges and risks. With great power comes new risks. AI isn't perfect. It can make mistakes or misinterpret tasks. Early versions might still need human oversight, like an autopilot that sometimes requires a pilot's help. And yes, automation could replace some jobs. But on the flip side, new roles will emerge to guide and improve AI systems. So, what does the future of work really look like? Part 10, the future of work, humans and AI working together. Instead of replacing people, AI will shift how we work. Imagine a workplace where AI assistants handle the repetitive tasks while humans focus on innovation. That's the future, a world where AI enhances human creativity and efficiency. Now, let's bring everything together. Part 11, final thoughts. Are you ready? Agentic AI isn't just another AI upgrade. 
It's a game changer. With new platforms launching and digital workers becoming the norm, businesses will never be the same. The question is, will you adapt and make the most of this revolution, or will you let it pass by? And here's what you can do next. Part 12, Take Action Now. Now, here's what you need to do next. Start learning how to use AI agents today. These tools are already changing the workplace, and understanding them now will put you ahead of the curve. Subscribe to this channel because in the next videos, I'll show you exactly how to use AI agents step by step. Don't miss out. Hit the subscribe button now and stay ahead of the AI revolution.